Morning brings day two the city's effort to get younger children vaccinated against the coronavirus by bringing the shots right to their schools. But a crush of demand and some short supplies left many sites overwhelmed on Monday. CBS News John Diaz joins us live from a school in Brooklyn where a pop up vaccine site will be running later this morning. John. Chris and Mayor, these pop up sites are supposed to be a one day clinic. So you can imagine the frustration a lot of parents experienced yesterday thinking that their child missed the opportunity, their opportunity to get a shot at their school. However, though, Mayor Bill de Blasio is saying that they will be adding extra resources and another day to some of these schools, if possible, if needed, right away. Vaccine hopefuls met with headaches on Monday at school sites across the city. On the first day, the Pfizer shot was available at select schools. Plenty of problems disappointed parents and some of the city's youngest eligible residents, most bumping into lack of supply. How long did you wait to get that shot? Six hours. Long lines sneaking around buildings outside at least a dozen schools in Manhattan and Brooklyn, including public school 40 on East 19th Street. Parents tell us the van was hours late and didn't even have the Pfizer doses for kids at first. This was just horrendously executed. And in Borum Hill, Brooklyn. I was pretty irate. I was like, no, we're not leaving here without a vaccine. Courtney Frank and her 11-year-old daughter eventually had no other option. After waiting two hours, they and two dozen other families were turned away from her middle school defeated. And they said that they were going to start at 7 and end at 11. And they started two hours late and ended an hour early. Monday night, the school sent a note to families apologizing for the problems. But Frank now plans on taking her daughter to get vaccinated at a private facility in Midtown. For them, the long-awaited protection and peace of mind can't wait another day. I think it'll be really exciting because then I'll feel like I can go places more and see more people. The mayor said four sites had a delay in getting vaccines, adding the city had tried to match supply of the youth vaccines with anticipated demand, but it seemingly didn't match up. Monday night, he acknowledged, but seemed to downplay the problems. Things went really well in the schools by and large today. We found about a dozen or so schools where there are some issues, so we're addressing those immediately, uh, getting additional vaccine to schools that need them, giving them another day uh, of uh, vaccine activity. Now nearly 17,000 kids ages 5 to 11 years old here in this city have already gotten the COVID vaccine uh, since Thursday. That was the first day this age group was able to get the shot. We're live this morning from Williamsburg, Brooklyn. John Diaz, CBS 2 News. John, thank you.